Yo guys, we are on. We are ready to go with some uh direct Nintendo Direct guys. If you haven't seen the Nintendo Direct, we are gonna go alive with it. We are going to see what this direct is all about. I've only got some of the highlights, my friends, so nothing really too that I know too much about, but I do know we did get a new Zelda. So we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna get started with the direct, guys. I'm going to react to the direct. Let's go ahead and get started, guys. Let me make sure everything is on. Second. And we are gonna get going. Ew, not Nintendo. Hey, Rocky, what is up, buddy? Hopefully it's patching through. Yep, there we are. Giving a bit for you. <laughs> Not being weird again. <laughs> is it forcing the? Is it forcing the source again? Most likely forcing the source again. Hopefully, it'll smooth out. And what are we getting here first? Looks like it's gonna be a Mario and Luigi RPG type game. Some sort of Mario RPG. Yep, it's like a Mar uh, Mario and Luigi RPG. Not Paper Mario. Like that uh, Mario Luigi series they got out. Now oh, that's gonna be a little, a little distracting. <laughs> Little distracting. Let me see if I can. Maybe I should have made that every 10 minutes, guys. Mario and Luigi Brothership. I'm not sure I like the name too well, but it does look like it's a fun game. Not really for me though. I'm not really much for those type of games. I'll be your guide for today's Nintendo Direct. It's a little low. See if I can turn it up just a tad. Entry in the Mario and Luigi series in almost nine years. Mario and Luigi Brothership. How's that, guys? That's a little louder. Forward to a seafaring I can hear it now. Unfolds across mysterious islands, as well as evolved Bros moves with Mario and Luigi. Okay, let's see the first batch of headlines. Bring the championships home or on the go. I get you guys. The Nintendo World Championships is heading to the Nintendo I'm turning Switch off the bot, guys. The bot's being a little annoying. Take on over 150 speedrunning challenges from across 13 NES games. From lightning fast beats to action packed battles. Time out. I'm going to time out stream bots for a, minute, for a while. Familiarize yourself <laughs> with each challenge and perfect your Being timing. a little annoying, guys. Then give it your best shot and aim for the top of the online leaderboards. You can also try more difficult legend challenges. Like completing Super Mario Brothers in one go using warp pipes. Stuck on a legend challenge? Check out classified information for handy tips and tricks I to did, help you um, improve. Put your skills up, uh, to the picking test this in one survival up. mode. Where you'll race against ghost data of players worldwide. Kind of looking After forward to round, playing this one. I did pick this one up. Eliminated. You've only got one shot to survive. Will you be the last one standing? Hopefully Nintendo not. Nintendo <laughs> World Championships NES Edition launches on Nintendo Switch July 18th. 
pre-orders for the digital yep. version are available now on Nintendo eShop. What? Digital? A deluxe pre set oh, containing well, a physical version of the game and other bonus items is also available for pre-order. The final battle of Fairy Tale is about to begin. Ikuzo, happy! Huzzah! Relive the climactic Alvarez Empire arc from the hit anime fairy tale in this action RPG. Set in the vast kingdom of Fiore, Team Natsu prepares to finish their fight. Engage in real-time battles and unleash powerful attacks that fuse different kinds of magic based on who's in your party. Work together yeah, with your this is not something for me. <laughs> Fairy Tale 2 launches on Fairy Nintendo Tale. Switch this winter. Okay, I have no idea. <laughs> Embark on a multi-dimensional journey. From Final Fantasy series creator Hironobu Sakaguchi. Okay, that could be something Nobuo good. Uematsu, comes the turn-based <laughs> RPG Fantasian. The world is slowly being robbed of its civilization. To restore his memories, Leo must confront an evil entity threatening all mankind. Okay. Skills are the ticket to winning battles. Adjust a skill's trajectory to target multiple enemies at once. Okay. You can also send enemies you've encountered to a separate dimension and fight them later. The more enemies there are, the more you can wipe out in one shot. Let them go! Now, let us save the world together. Fantasian Neo Dimension launches on Nintendo Switch this holiday. Might have to look more into that. I'm, I don't know Another about something for me. Another coming to Spoko Square. Wait, something new to Switch Sports? Basketball is being added as a free update to the Nintendo Switch Sports game. Dribble. Pass. Ew, motion controls. And shoot. <laughs> In two-on-two -two matches using motion controls. Might be good for party for parties, but I don't think streaming three -point would, solo this type of game would be good for streaming, but it'd be, the time limit. be fun for parties. Up to four players can also compete in five streak battle. If I ever get out. <laughs> Besides local play, you can team up with If I ever get out and have a party with a friend. Online matches. This free update for Nintendo Switch Sports dunks its way onto Nintendo Switch this summer. Which I probably won't pick up. Okay, what is this? What is this? Okay. Memories and Orb. Interesting. It's an array of cartoon classics. Leap into a new update for Disney Illusion Island. Mom's oh, new update. Um, Bailey would like that. And only Mickey and friends can help. In the I think she plays adventure, this one. Mystery and Monarch. No, uh, Jeeps played this one. Throughout the world, 
Then use the dashboard to crack each case. What big secret lies at the end? Start sleuthing because this Hi Josh, welcome in, buddy. Nintendo Switch later today. I've got alerts um, muted right I'm now, but welcome in, bud. Wait. How are you doing? Customize your character. Then befriend Hello Kitty, Karomi, oh, and other great. familiar faces Everyone's in Everyone's favorite game, Hello adventure. Kitty. Team up with your new pals to solve mysteries Do well, and restore thanks. Friendship Island when Have you watched this already, buddy, or is this your first time time watching this as well? The Nintendo Switch system next year. <laughs> Let's get loony in this wacky sports game. Oh, well, I was going to say, is this like Let's Space Jam? Bunny, Daffy Duck, Pippin' a Ton, Pig, and more across four arcade style watch it out 10 this morning unleash the full power of i'm skipping a ton levels in up to four player local co am i skipping for anyone else hot josh am i skipping for you buddy wacky world of sports crashes on not seeing anything in the red over here what's up doc that's all folks let's see if you somebody confirm am i skipping a lot new crewmate and imposter roles are being added to among us Alert others when eliminated as a noisemaker. Plant Yesterday I was, not now though. A tracker, or Must be your end, Rocky. Taking out players That's weird. As a phantom. Cause I'm Sons not in the red at all over this here. Free update for Among Us sneaks onto Nintendo Switch later today. Oh, free update for Among Us. A monster army is at your command. I haven't played that game in a while. This is Felicidad, a realm of monsters. Those who command and raise them are called Farmagia and play a vital role what in the world this? civilization. Ten of Farmagia must rise up against the oppressive Magus to stop his vicious reign of the underworld. Raise monsters and lead them into the fight against the Magus's army. Plant seeds, then cultivate, and harvest them to make your buddies come to life. They can then be trained for battle. Give commands to your monsters and exploit enemy weaknesses in action-packed combat. Take this. Merge all the battle buddies not for in your party <laughs> to call forth a giant fusion summon and wreak havoc That's on That's not your calling foes. to me at all. Might be fun for somebody, but I. Don't see myself Join playing the rebellion that. To stop the Magus in Farmagia, launching on Nintendo Switch November 1st. This is my first time. Oh, wait, wait. What's going on here? Donkey Kong Country Returns, originally released on the Wii system, is barreling onto Nintendo Switch. Nice. Okay. <laughs> the villainous Tiki Tiki now we're talking. Has hypnotized the local wildlife and stolen Donkey Kong's precious banana hoard. <laughs> Obstacles in the way? Oh, yes. Just I remember them. playing this. I really love this game. It was like my favorite Donkey Kong and Country. Roll on through. Each level is filled with hijinks, but they're no match for these top bananas. From manic mine carts to high-flying rocket barrels. Brancher, welcome in. Thank you and even for the follow. How are you Randy. doing? There are plenty of transportation. Oh, we're gonna available. definitely be playing this again. Pass a Joy-Con controller to a buddy for two players. Welcome to the herd. Color. How are you doing? 80 appealing levels are in store, including the additional levels from the Nintendo 3DS version. Oh wait. They're adding more levels. Donkey Kong Country Returns HD. Swing. Oh, I'm getting that for my birthday, guys. January <laughs> my birthday's January 12th, so I'll definitely be picking that one up. Donkey Kong and Diddy Kong's Jungle Escapades. So my birthday's on the 12th, so four days late, but I'll pick that up. Plenty of wild actions and antics are in store with these Kongs. And bonus levels? Next. Of course I'll take, take it. Look at this. <laughs> Time is nay.
Power of Awakening draws near. What do we got? Ooh, a new Dragon Quest. Never really got into the Dragon Quest games. Here they're Journey good, though. With allies to face the I'm gonna have to theme. play a Dragon Quest, see if I like it. On an epic adventure. I can't say if I like it or not. Memorable encounters. I've never played a Dragon Quest. Perplexing challenges. And formidable monsters await. An iconic RPG remade in HD 2D. Forge your own path. I should have made it every 10 minutes. The legacy begins. A little bit. <laughs> Dragon Quest 3 HD 2D Remake. Well, it's a remake of the Come third game. Nintendo See, Switch, I never got November into Dragon 14. Quest, so I don't know. I don't know if it'd be for me. I'll have to check her out. There's more. Eric. Dragon Quest 1 and 2 is getting a remake too. So we're going to get 1, 2, and 3. Okay. Nintendo Direct. Welcome to the video. Hello, everyone. I'm Holly Yuji. How did you feel about Dragon Quest 3? How did you 僕も嬉しく思います。ドロゴンクエスト1&2も、1&2も、1&2も、1&2も、1&2も、1&2も、1&2も、1&2も、1&2も、1&2も、1&2も、1&2も、1&2も、1&2も、1&2も、1&2も
Ooh, Metal, slug. Metal Slug. I haven't played a Metal Slug in forever. Of the Metal Slug series. Take control of your forces and pulverize enemy strongholds. Choose from over 300 units with different abilities and build out your decks to win tactical tussles. That was a fun um, arcade game, Metal Slug. Slug it out with other I haven't played it in ages, so. I remember playing it back in the day. Storms onto the had so much of fun with Metal Slug. Today. Embark on an expedition of the damned in this eagerly awaited sequel to the gothic roguelike RPG. Board your stagecoach and set off across a decaying landscape to prevent an apocalypse. This looks actually off, promising. Speeds in turn -based combat. I don't know if I like turn based combat. <laughs> after each I like my run. combat head to head. Darkest Dungeon 2 launches on Nintendo Switch July 15th. Pre orders begin later today on Nintendo eShop. Well, I'll give it a look. I'll see if I like it, but. More classic I don't know. titles are on the way. Ooh. Switch online. Ooh, another way to play Link to the Past. Classic 16 bit adventure and team up online to explore randomized dungeons in The Legend of Zelda A Link to the Past Four Swords. The Four Swords, nice. Experience the remake of Samus's first adventure in Metroid Zero Mission. Plus, coming to the new Nintendo 64, Nintendo Switch Online Mature 17 Plus collection of games. Wait, what? Brave the dangerous lost land to stop the campaigner's nefarious Ooh, schemes in Turok, Dinosaur Hunter. I used to love playing that back in the day. Infiltrate a corporation. Welcome. To Thank you for the follow. Conspiracy in Glad to have you in here. Now with online multiplayer. All four games will be available for Nintendo Switch Online Plus Expansion Pack members later today. Set sail to save the day. How are you doing today? How are you? This is Verona, a young woman. Can't say your name, but welcome in. With phantoms. I will take all of this girl. Join her on a journey to save her friend, Ash. in this new installment in the Phantom Brave series. Take on tactical turn-based battles where you'll combine the phantoms you've befriended with objects in various ways. Combine phantoms with certain objects to maneuver them. Combine with a cannon to attack a large area a fan to blow enemies around. Or combine with Morona herself for show-stopping abilities that can turn the tide of battle. Phantom Brave, the Lost Hero, launches on Nintendo Switch next year. This one's gonna take you for a ride. Wait, are we getting a new Street Fighter? Seven arcade games featuring Wait. Marvel and Capcom characters are fighting their way onto Nintendo Switch as one collection. Clash in Nice, X -Men Marvel vs. Capcom. Duke it out in Marvel vs. Capcom 2 New Age of Heroes. Take down the Kingpin in the beat em up Ooh. side scroll of the Punisher. I remember and playing more. that one. I remember playing that one, guys. Hit up training in the arcade to punish your skills and combos. Love that game in the, online in, to challenge rivals at my local the arcade. Love that game. Or play co op in the Punisher. You can also cross over to the museum to view artwork or listen to music from each game. I hope they added uh, the X Men arcade. Marvel versus Capcom Fighting Collection Arcade Classics launches on Nintendo Switch this year. Sometime this year. <laughs> to a bigger boulder, a new Mario, Mario Party? Party series takes place on an enormous island resort. 
Get ready to jump into the biggest selection of Mario Party. But we got to buy a new Mario Party. Super They're Mario not going to give us Jamboree. like more maps for First, let's superstars. See the They're going to make us buy a new Mario Party. Stars. Are you kidding Take me? The escalators to travel between floors in Rainbow Galleria. Use in-game coins to yeah, get a star I already bought superstars. Why do I want to buy another fast. Mario Party? And stay on track in Raceway. Oh, now I'm mad about With this. Turbo dice it looks good. You can move uh, up I'll give it that, but I really don't want to buy another Mario Here Party. I would have rather they put this the in superstars, guys. <laughs> That's my and opinion. Really get mixed up when the volcano blows but I'll top. probably buy it anyway. Along with five new game boards, two boards from previous Mario Party games make their return. Just hate that I Some have to do that. Some games are action-packed challenges, speed trials, a battle of wits, and more. And some are Hi, how are you shaking, doing? <laughs> or tilting your Joy-Con I, I maps and I map scenario. How are you doing today? There's a wide variety to enjoy. Yeah, it's also, been out for a while, but still, I would have loved them to do um, can go head -to -head DLC and not uh, compete and not against your rivals and give us another game. First place. Try your best to come out on top. Wait, there are even more new modes? The biggest Mario Party yet will soon be underway when the Super Mario Party Jamboree game launches on the Nintendo Switch system October 17th. Any more of those come through, Hot Josh, please, man. In the Mario Party series, Super Mario Party Jamboree, with new boards, mini games, 20 player online gameplay and more get ready for the biggest mario party in series history and now please take a look at this i was about to ban i see you Stuart. what is this is this a zelda game they were talking about earlier yes it's zelda Whoa, right in the fray. We got Ganon, we got Link. This looks good so far. Wait, what? And you know my feelings on Zelda. <laughs> hey, J Rug, what's up, buddy? Just so you guys know, all our uh, distraction stuff's down this evening. So, wait a second. Are we playing in some... Look at that world. Oh, my goodness. So, is this top-down, or what is this? Is this open world? Is this top-down? What are we looking at here? Hello, everyone. I'm A.G. Aonuma. Producer of the Legend of Zelda series. Hey, AG. What you got for us? What you just saw was the latest installment, The Legend of Zelda Echoes of Wisdom. I'm going to have to get that as a wallpaper, around, guys. Link that looks so good. Now, it's up to Princess Zelda <laughs> to step into the protagonist role. You might be thinking, will Zelda fight with a sword then? Here, we will wanted she? to create a new gameplay style that breaks conventions seen in past Legend of Zelda games with a top-down perspective. To explain more, please take a look at this video. Stolen away. Across the vast lands of Hyrule, strange rifts have appeared and have taken many people including Link. Now alone, Zelda meets the fairy Tri, receives Try. a mysterious staff called the Tri. That doesn't look like a fairy to me. On a journey across Hyrule to <laughs> save her kingdom. Nobody better say By it doesn't look like my people. At a table she found, Zelda learned how to create an imitation of it called an echo. Once you learn an echo of something, you can recreate it whenever you'd like. Even if there's a wall blocking your path, you can create echoes of tables to get a leg up. Just like that. 
you can create wooden boxes, old beds, and unusual nice. <laughs> things like water blocks. All right. How you use them separately or together. So she's basically got one that like makes things. Learn and create echoes of things you find while exploring Hyrule. You might be surprised at what you discover. Even battles will look different. You could pick up and throw a rock echo, for example. That's not all, though. You can also create echoes of monsters. After doing so, oh, so you can use monsters side. on monsters. Monsters have different abilities, so choose the one you want to create based on the situation. Wisdom is key. Hang on, I'm after gonna. All. I'm gonna turn off our Streamlabs bot, guys. Let's see if I can turn you off. Streamlabs. Seeing a little bit of a nuisance, guys. Hang on. In a high room Hold on, ban it later. The fate of the kingdom is now in Zelda's hands. <laughs> What's up, Japes? How was that? I How was you your uh, stream, buddy? Of the echo ability, which channels Princess Zelda's wisdom. There are a lot of echoes in this game. <laughs> to be honest, I haven't counted them all yet. Thank you for the shout out to Japes. How you solve puzzles and battle enemies will change depending on the echoes used. In short, we've created a game where each player's experience will be different. The Legend of Zelda Echoes of Wisdom launches September 26th. September 26th, so that's relatively a soon then. Switch light system inspired by the Legend of Zelda series will Time also with be family before bed. Launch. Hey, no worries, we hope man. We're looking forward to playing as Zelda in this new adventure. It looks now, okay. I I'd mean, like I would have rather play this link, but everyone's been wanting um, everyone's been wanting a game where you play as Thank you, Zelda, so Please look forward we'll take to it. the newest entry in the Legend of Zelda series. <laughs> Let's see a few more headlines. I would have rather it have been in 3D, not 2D, Let D, though. And party on. <laughs> I need to set it a little bit better. That's on me. <laughs> we can time it out for now. I might time it out for now. It's being a little bit of a, a butt. I'm going to time it out for a while. Oh no, another just dance. Yo, Renegade, what is up, buddy? Have you seen this direct yet? And why do I feel like we're gonna get a copyright strike for, <laughs> for just dance here, guys? Hopefully not. A new Lego adventure is on the horizon. It's the world of Horizon in Lego form. We got a new Lego Join game. I've never been Aloy too much into to save the world from an ancient Lego. Oh, wait, they're making a Horizon? Dive deep into the Lego? Cauldrons. That's Climb a Sega. Or not a Sega. Sony uh, franchise. By the original game. But be careful. Swarms of machines so we don't get everywhere. the uh, original Horizon. Use an array of but they're like going to give us a Lego Horizon on the Switch. Down. Wait, what? The nimble watchers to mighty sawtooths. Yeah, we you don't get the original Horizon, the but they're giving us a Lego job. Horizon. As you progress... You can help Aloy rebuild her home and customize her appearance with lots of outfits. Might be fun though. <laughs> oh, and you don't have to explore this vast wilderness alone. I mean, if we don't get the, from the original horizon, horizon local or why not give us Lego? Lego? Yeah, it doesn't look too bad. Adventures launches on Nintendo Switch this holiday. I just hope they give us the original horizon though. A Probably not. Journey begins. They're giving us Stray too. I love Stray. I played Stray. Graphics look decent. Not as good as PS4 or PS5, but it looks de decent. 
This is where you started watching. <laughs> Experience a decaying cyber city through the eyes it of the cat. It looks a little different. From their family and friends. Explore alongside a drone known as B12. Looks a little. Graphics home. look a little different. Still looks good though. To the I need to rebuy because uh, for they're kind of forcing me on my PlayStation Plus to buy it now. Like they had it free at one point, but now they're forcing the me to buy it. And I never Careful finished though. playing it, not so is excited to have you it's one of the ones we did not finish playing, and I really want to get swarm. back and do it. Keep exploring to venture into more Might areas pick it up for Switch. Familiar world and make your way back to safety. I'll see how good it is first. I might either pick it up for Switch or I'm gonna pick it up for PS5. Might pick it up PS5. I don't know if I'm gonna buy it for Switch. Depends on how much. Home, Hobbit. If you've ever wanted to live like a Hobbit from the Lord of the Rings, now a leisurely existence nestled away in an idyllic quiet corner of Middle Earth can be yours. Customize your appearance. Decorate your home. I'd rather have the battles too the with my Lord of the Rings games. To the Not just be a hobbit. You'll befriend your neighbors, work together to solve problems, and even share a meal. Well, it's kind of like an Animal explore, Crossing, but for hobbits. Party, fish, forage, and cook. The best way to build a hobbit community is by hosting a dinner party with your homemade dishes. Plus, you can trade with your neighbors for unique decorations or special ingredients for even tastier meals. Friendly hobbits and familiar faces await your arrival when Tales of the Shire launches on the Nintendo Switch system this holiday. Investigate, interrogate, checkmate. Objection! Two Ace Attorney Not spin another games. Ace Attorney game. <laughs> I swear I'm getting tired of these Ace Attorney games. Never really been interested in them. As the prolific prosecutor Miles Edgeworth I never played these the either. Case out of the courtroom and investigate crime scenes. Gather information by interviewing but people. But a lot of people love a lot of people love them. Then so use the power of logic to solve challenging cases. So apparently they're Into continuing making them because a lot of people love them from the original series character designer or swap to the original sprites for a more classic look. Take a break from your investigation to explore the gallery where you'll find character art, music, including orchestral arrangements, and more. Past and present collide as you uncover the truth at any cost. Ace Attorney Investigations Collection launches on Nintendo Switch yeah. September 6th. <laughs> Spin-offs, I think. Begin later today on Nintendo eShop. For somebody who wants Ace Attorney, it's available today. Not for me, though. What's this? What is this? What the heck is that thing? <laughs> a devastating attack by unknown assailants, Takumi Samino's life gets turned upside down. A mysterious school mascot suddenly appears. My opinion was the Zelda trailer. Out of harm's way. So far, so far. He's then so forced far. to enroll at the Last Defense Academy, along with 15 I like Donkey Kong students. Country, too, that we're getting Donkey Kong back. And it's four days after my birthday, guys. So I might throw it up on my throne wish list, guys. Anyone wants to buy it? That's up to you guys. <laughs> An academy shrouded in secrecy. And or I'll buy it myself. One of the two. Can Takumi survive this but I might throw it up on my throne, too. And despair and Anyone wants to give me a birthday present? <laughs> the creators of Don Gun Rampa present the Hundred Line Last Defense Academy, launching on Nintendo Switch early next year. Not for me, though. Embark on a saga spanning generations. Oh, I thought it said Sega. <laughs> a full remake of Romancing Saga 2 is marching on to Nintendo Switch. I have people really liking the Romancing Saga series. I mean, it looks open the world. Of Beren across multiple generations while challenging the I hear a lot of people like this one. Who have turned to darkness. 
I do love games with sword play. Looks like it's RPG though. And formations to enhance nah, I'm not be I'm not good with formations though. Turn-based battles have also evolved into timeline battles. I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> is this would be one for me. Innovative features like you Looks fun though. Can also help with strategy. How will you expand your empire? And in which order will you fight the seven heroes? Every decision you make will dramatically alter the course of the story. Safeguard your empire's future and protect your legacy from peril. Otherwise, the vengeful seven heroes may emerge victorious. Romancing Saga 2 Revenge of the Seven launches on Nintendo Switch October 24th. Yeah, not for me. We hope you're excited to experience the full remake of Romancing Saga 2. That's almost everything for today's Nintendo Direct. Almost everything. Where are you keeping up? Please take a look. What is this? What is this? What is this? You've got to be kidding me. We waited seven years for this. Oh my goodness, I am not okay right now. And I still gotta play remastered. I haven't finished it yet. I still gotta finish it. Then I gotta go play two. I gotta play three. It's been 10,000 years. <laughs> Feels like it. It's been 84 years. <laughs> All right, shut up and take my money. <laughs> Is it coming out this year? When's it coming out? Is it a holiday game? Metroid Prime 4. Beyond, okay, Metroid Prime 4 Beyond. Okay, so that was a great 2025. Oh, nice. So it's coming out 2025. That was a first look at Metroid Prime 4 <laughs> Beyond. I'm going to have to read. After a very long time, we are finally able to share more information about this title. Okay, so what do you got? The release is planned for 2025. 2025. So please wait a little bit longer. We hope you're looking forward to Samus. Wait a little bit longer. That means you're gonna port it to the next Nintendo okay, system. That's all for today's Nintendo Direct. Thank you for watching. Oh wow. <laughs> well, thank you guys for jumping.